This tutorial will be mainly on Turbo Robot Profit Maximizer 2.0 tutorials. What you will learn on this topic, first is basics of functions and parts of the AA. Second, settings va value and impact of the trade. Third, basic capital calculations and level on its lot size. So why calculations? It's because this AA is mainly on calculations, not a base signal AA. So calculation, you know, why is the best because you will know what is your rest level. So whatever settings you add in, you put in. So make sure you will know what is that calculation, what is that settings all about, and fit to your calcula calculation. So the, the AA will follow on that calculation. All right. So by the end of this training, you should be able to set up properly on your profitable settings after this training video. So we have here the next is our product manual. So product manual, you are downloading this together with your EA when you open into our website. So we have our 16 page. This is a full copy manual. So when you brought an e our EA, so it has together with a full copy. So we will teach you everything here. And we have a risk adversary in the first place. So we have put in warning over here you should treat forex trading as your business not one-time millionaire mindset if your attitude of a one-time millionaire you will lead to losing your money so i believe this uh, phrase here is really true all right so next you have your setup ea over here so setup ea we have sent you a video about this on how to set up in video uh, format all right so next is our notice here so this AA is based on calculation AA and not a signal AA so once expert advisor enabled it will automatically open your trade and make sure to check the product manual this product manual that go to bring together with you so on the correct settings all right here is um, parts of the AA and tabs definition so in your inputs tabs you have a two columns over here so first is a variable this portion and uh, you have a value over here so this portion will be the one your settings and this is our available um, parameters all right so first is your trade mode you can select here either buy and sell or sell buy, sell all or buy only all right so in your buy mode i think you, it has an explain over here so on buy mode you can select either you want only buy or you want sell or in buy sell you either your ea will be buy and sell trading all right so this perform hedging so this is the reason why we have a buy and sell put together to perform your hedging so recommended settings this is the recommended settings is because you have to hedging your um trade so if you set only sell, if you prefer that you have to select only sell on your trading, so it will only use sell portion. If you buy only, so it will only buy. So it's not on uh, hedging. So buy sell will bring you to hedging. So the next thing is a buy mode. So buy mode, you can select either you want both or martingale and martingale. So martingale means you are double up your lot size on your losing side so anti martingale means you are doubling up your lot size as well but on your profit so which means you are always secure your profit so first settings later i will go through to you with this in our mt4 so first settings is both so this is our recommended settings you know why it's because you are performing anti martingale and also martingale together all right so let's say you are choosing only martingale so these settings will perform only on uh, your buy trade let's say you are in a buy trade so if it is a losing trade it will perform only on the martingale all right so for your anti martingale so let's say you are selecting on your buy trade and it is profitable so buy trade will double up your lot size to secure your profit all right so this is mainly on one sided this is the main um good things for this aa because 
the moment you do profit he will secure for you that profit and then he will continue um, open up trade on that particular uh, one-sided trading all right so this manual it will bring you an explanation on how it's calculated and uh, how the level and the position let open and the explanation of um, your martingale option and recommendation we have a both uh, recommendations here all right so next is our settings on the losing position so this is mainly on your martingale option so first you have your martingale option so you have a magic number later i will explain to you in your mt4 so you have your lot size started so whatever what lot size you want to start so it might this one must have a calculation before you start it and how many levels is because this is the risk portion that you have to calculate whatever your profit is in opposite side or your um, possible in your losing side but you still can manage it okay so make sure you know how this is calculated later on and i will explain to you so this is, we have advices and tips for our this manual so multiplier i will explain to you as well how how it's being multiplied so take profits okay and this is our distance position so you have your strategy and how open the position so i'll explain to you very well here and definitely you will be understand on how it works and uh, we have advices and tips for full copy and then you have illustration and how it how is the tp and how is the next level has been implemented all right so pretty explain over here and then your max position level per side and then you have your advices and tips for this um, particular position so uh, for you to understand you know, what is the level um, okay and we have a uh, tips and cap of your capital so recommended for sense account so make sure if you are below uh, 5k 5000 US dollar so you should start with the uh, sense account so the better is a sense accounts because you can uh, you can multiply and you can uh, add up your levels very well okay so also for standard account we have also these tips and your lot proper side so this is your profitable open position so this is your anti martingale all right so so this is the one and you start with lot size as well it's the same with our martingale and that um, the, just now so you have your martingale profit side and then explain very well on your manual especially on your full copy all right so the distance position how it is open up and also advices and tips and also your distance position where is your t um tpsl okay all right so we have an explanation all this and we have a settings advice as well so your max position layer on your profit side and also your margin level so the margin level is the most important here is because it is because you can set your ea let's say you wanted to set let's say the default setting is 2k or 2000 percent so if 2000 percent means your ea below 2000 percent it won't trade for you anymore because for you to save your um, capital and uh, it will protect your capital all right so more than 2000 percent so the a will still function so the moment that it reached down to 2000 percent or let's say you are putting like maybe 3000 percent it depends on you so that is your calculation there is this is the risk that um you have to go through all right so the next option is um this is mainly on the display so it doesn't uh, affect on your settings on your trade uh it doesn't it's just uh, show you on the trade where is the trade now and how many levels all right so this is our full copy uh, tr tested value that you can set up okay this is mainly only only a full 
full copy manual and we have adjustments over here and depends on you okay all right so we have also our best currency to choose on this um, ea because we have chosen and we this um, currency because we have tried this in live so we have trading advice as well and yeah that is for the manual so next we will be showing up to you on how is the settings and uh, the AA the settings of the AA. so make sure you will be on your demo account so this is your MT4 so our turbo robot profit maximizer is over here so the moment that you drag it over here then it will bring you to the settings all right so this is your inputs so remember that you have your trade mode just now we are discussing on our manual so you have a trade mode you can either buy and sell or buy and sell so this is uh, the recommended settings is a buy sell so your buy mode if your buy position of your buy trade either you want it to be a martingale only or you want it to be anti martingale so remember that martingale is on losing position all right so if you are on anti martingale it will be double up and it is this is mainly on profit position all right the moment it that particular trade is on profit so it will perform this under martingale later we will explain to you on how this martingale anti martingale works so you can set it both so that they will perform both either way so if your sell trade or sell mode it's the same thing you can uh, because in forex you can buy and you can sell right so you can either choose martingale uh, anti martingale or both so our recommendation is you choose it both all right so this particular settings over here so this portion is concentrating mainly on martingale all right so martingale whatever settings that you have done here remember that you have a buy mode and sell mode so you can select either martingale or both or under martingale so this is your settings will be affect on this portion all right so if your trade is on buy mode or sell mode if it is in profitable so you can um, this is the settings will affect this particular settings over here so this portion will be the settings on your uh, this uh, this area so it will be the settings for your profit so you you are always securing your profit in this uh, position all right so let's say your uh, first thing is here on your martingale settings there is a magic number so this magic number will affect to all of these settings all right so magic number means you can select this so i will try and how is it so let's say you have a us a euro usd so if you have a euro usd 2 so first settings you have done this this particular settings over here so you can put it like magic number one all right so the settings will be one the value but if you have if you wanted to set with another settings whereby this the same currency pay so you can set it different way maybe this one will put like 25 or depends on you then you can change it to two all right or three or four it depends on you but this is mainly only on the same um currency pair what if you have another currency pair so if you have another currency pair no problem you can uh, maintain your magic number if the same is doesn't ma it doesn't matter all right so that is magic number how uh, all about so your lot size depends on you and uh, your calculation so how much is your lot size and maybe you can start with one or you can start with uh, you can start with two you can start with one uh, depends on you so this is how much is your risk that you're going to um, absorb later on all right so this is a good thing here you must know how this calculation works later i will explain to you and it teach you on how this explaining uh, um large size started will be working on okay so multiplier so whatever large size you have here here this particular portion 
so your multiplier will be based on this lot size so let's say you started one so the next multiplier will be two so the, um, this is how you multiply your lot size whatever since this portion is a losing portion whatever this trade is become loose it will become uh, double so it, be, it goes to martingale position all right so tp your take profit will be on pips so how much is your tp that you want to take after um losing once the re uh, reverse back all right so i will explain to you later on about this so your distance position so distance position to open pips okay remember that you have lot size then you are uh multiplied with it after the next uh pips so this is your distance position all right so i'll explain to you in this so your um profit position so maximum trade layer this is either in the pool settings is 100 you can change it with 10 or may depends on you or your 11 or 100 depends on you but this one will have to calculate based on your capital so later on we will share you on your drawdown if you put it like maybe 10 or put it 11 how much is your drawdown possible if you hit that particular uh, numbers all right so for this portion i will give you some illustration over here and um, how it works all right okay here yeah. so this is your level so remember you have your level and maybe uh, you set it until 10 level so remember here you have your levels or layer of your uh, position all right so distance to open position let's say how much is your distance to open up your next position so this is uh, maybe you can say like 15 or 20 or 25 it depends on you so where is this portion where's this portion in your mt4 will be this one all right so your lot size what is your starting lot size and how much the next lot size after that when you reach this level that you are setting okay so where is this lot size came from will be here all right so this is your 0 0.01 and this is your 0 0.01 okay so let's say the next um level or the next after 15 pips this one after 15 pips reach so you this is your second lot size if let's say another 15 pips this is another lot size another lot size so until it reached to uh 10 pips at uh, 10 level sorry so total of this lot size will be 150 pips if you reach uh, times 10 level so the question is what if it doesn't uh reach or uh, it will return reverse back so for that case i will explain to you and give you an illustration on how it works all right so here i will explain to you an illustration on how it works on level and your lot size all right so we will start with uh, okay let's say this is your um first lot on second one third one and maybe fourth one okay or this is too near all right maybe yeah all right <clears throat> okay so let's say this is your sell trade and your sell trade suppose it will drop uh, it will go down if this is earning but in opposite side so this is your martingale how the martingale works when your trade either buy or sell is on uh, losing side all right so let's say this is your um so this is your um, sell trade um, either your buy or sell is the same so let's say it started from x1 so this is your times one over here your level your times two here and your times three here and your times four so your lot size if you're on times one it will start with 0 0.01 and your x2 will be 0 0.02 and then because this is martingale so times uh, times three will be four and uh, zero four and then uh, four will be 0 0.08 all right so let's say 
this portion here you are um, so this one will go up until how many level right so depends so if you set until 10 level it will going up until 10 level all right so we will say that uh, the starting position will be here so let's say your trade is like this and uh, it's losing suppose because your sell trade but it's losing and then it is going up all right then it hits your second level i mean your x2 so let's say it hits to say x2 so your settings here is 15 pips so it means this is 15 pips all right so 15 from here down to here is 15 pips all right so let's say for example it hits then it will reverse back and then it will come back again all right so i think you are if you are a manual trader you should know how is this works and i mean how is the uh, market calculation uh, performance let's say it comes out like this so if, if this is let's say you're open x1 and you're already open and at the next level do i have a sl yes the aa will automatically open up your sl so remember that um, you have your set in your uh, no no it's not sl it's a tp so your tp will be here so your take take profit so your take profit will be open up here what it means by that after 15 pips it will go up but if let's say the trade or the market will shoot back going down so this portion is already earned but it doesn't close yet so the moment that it hits over here it will close these two so these two will automatically close and it will open up new trading start from 0 0.01 okay what if this trade is, is still going up and uh, uh, it doesn't go down here it doesn't go down but it's still going up two and then it triggers two times three or main means your lot size will be times um, uh, 0.04 so it triggers here so it will open up new lot size a new trade so the good thing for this EA if we say it hits the next sip so it will open up another TP over here so this TP since this one is not close this one is not close so this TP will transfer over here and this X1 and X2 will follow on this TP and then this X3 will follow this TP alright so the moment it reached down back and hit so which means all these three trades will close up alright so what if it will still continue going up and then hits another 50, this one 15 15 pips and then this another 15 pips and it triggers to your x4 or your uh, times 4 lot size here so you, you should be familiar on this market so the, the moment that it triggers to x4 times 4 so means this portion the tp will transfer to here another tp here but this particular tp will be deleted so it will not be uh, tp anymore so his value will be here uh, this value here this x1 x2 x3 will be an x4 will be changed the tp over here the reason why is because the moment it it reached back let's say you are losing uh, uh, the, the trade is one in reverse so if this reverse back so your x4 is already earning right so profit all right so the profit will keep going down let's say it hits back here so you are losing this trade losing this trade and losing this but you are on times four remember that your times four lot is already 0.8 so if you calculate all this this one it doesn't matter all this losing here will be covered up by here times four this is the the good things and the beauty of martingale all right so it will cover up all your losses and it will clear off all uh, in profit all right so after that uh, it will close up all it will open another trade so it will open another trade started from 0 0.01 lot so this is your times one so it will go back again and again and again and again 
if the trade either sell or buy if it is buy is the same thing it's the same thing you will open up again and again so the same process that will go through all right so next we'll be explaining to you on um anti martingale or what if the market is on one sided it's just like this what's going on on my sell trade or what's going on on my another trade so that is anti martingale all right so this is the portion whereby your uh, trade let's say sell trade or buy trade you will be having a settings for this to your anti martingale so this portion will be covered on this area so this portion here all right so uh, we will be discussing the same as your um, martingale so this is your, for your anti martingale so this is for anti martingale so which means the moment that your trade sell or buy it is on profit position so this is the beauty of this ea because we did program this on the profit side so not just on losing side but you are on the profit side all right so let's say we will start with um, it's the same thing we will start with here is your oh let's say you're on sell mode okay okay so this portion this is your times two so times three this is your times four all right and this portion over here will be your uh, this trade is your sell trade and it is on profit mode profit all right okay sorry so that is in your profit mode so this is your x1 x1 this is your x2 so times two times three and your times four all right so this is your sell trade and it is goes to profit so which means that uh, okay so your trade over here start here and then it will this is your x1 so it will going down let's say it will profiting and it hits maybe so remember that your distance position here we put it maybe 30 pips so on this particular settings your next trade it should be on uh, higher the reason why there's a calculation why we will put higher okay so this is 30 pips um but then this from uh, distance between x1 and x2 is 30 pips our settings here so let's say it hits x2 and then where is your sl here so to secure your profit on x1 we have an x sl over here okay so the reason why if let's say the trade reverse back or the market reverse back it will hit up this one this is sl and then the particular sl will cover your losses let's say i mean your take care of your profit and your x2 is losing but you're only on uh, maybe put it like seven seven pips or eight pips so you are earning on uh, about 23 pips here because your minus of is 7 but your x2 you are losing at 7 pips so you're still earning all right so let's say it doesn't hit it doesn't go back so it will continue uh, profiting the x2 now is continue profiting and it keep going down and then it hits to your third uh, x3 so third um, tp uh, i mean open trade so the moment that it hits to this por portion so will it will change the sl is over here so this sl will not be anymore and this one will don't have sl so seven pips again from uh, this portion all right so the moment it uh, the market reverse back so you are taking the profit for both of these two and you're losing seven pips from here but you are earning both so you always keep your profit um and this martingale uh, anti-martingale mode 
So let's say it will not go with this uh, TP. It will not reverse. So keep coming down. And uh, it will trigger back again with the uh, X4 uh, for there. And then your TP or SL will change over here. All right. So this this SL will not be anymore. It will automatically change all all your X1 and X2 and X3 will change to this SL over here. So the reason why because the moment that the market reach back, so you're losing on X4, but you are earning all of this trade. So very pretty well uh, profit over here. So while if you are if your sell trade is on losing on the other side the, the the one just now we discussed but remember that your profit portion is still on working so it doesn't matter you're on one side or you're ranging the moment it, it let's say your market is like this is very good the moment is your market is just like this which means it's one sided you will cover up this so the market will all your profit will always earn so whenever the market reverse back so it will is always earning all right so this is how it works on um, the beauty of this martingale either you're losing or you're winning always win all right so okay i hope you're familiar with this and you are getting this very well and next tutorial will be i mean follow up on this video will be our um, explanation on uh, your drawdowns all right okay so if you have queries or inquiry about just now explanation on uh, martingale and ante martingale so please let us know by sending us an email at admin at forexpipsplus.com